I just stopped by the Hall of Fame here and the first thing is to read about this guy Ernie Punch McLean I'm not into hockey at all I'm not into hockey at all it's like a, for me hockey is like a parallel world and I start reading I start reading and I see this guy picture over there and an old guy shows up right here and he saw me reading and he said do you know who is that guy and I'm looking at the old guy and I said I don't know I'm not into hockey he said that's me and I'm looking at this okay he looks like this guy but it's it's older he's like 10 years older and that was freaking weird so this is something 2006 so now he is not that big he's not that uh, like a it's older he looks like an 80 something years old guy but still full of energy and i said i i don't really care about hockey but i care about special people <laughs> and he didn't get what i said i mean he was super alert but yeah my maybe my english he uh, he looked at me and he was very uh, proud that someone is uh, reading about his story over there. And I said, if I read about someone, that means that person is a special person. I don't read about anyone like that. So I said, you are different, you are special, you are a big soul. And uh, yeah, he smiled and I said, can I give you a hug? So I gave him a hug. He was not really excited to get a hug, but I gave him a hug. And uh, so he went, and I'm looking, he went with a young kid, maybe to take the young kid out of hockey or something, with like maybe a six, seven years old kid. Maybe he's a grandfather, I, I don't know. But I was like, a, what the heck, it's weird. Like I'm looking at something, and the guy just shows here. He's like, is this a freaking virtual reality? It's not a virtual reality. Like, uh, and it's not the first time it happens. Like, uh, I'm thinking some someone and a couple of minutes later, like, whoa, how come I just thought of this person? But this was weird. It was weird, especially when this was not a, a, a simple person. This is uh, someone who, you know, business owner, like it says there, business owner survived a plane crash in 1971. In 1971, I was a little baby, like I was a kid. Like, uh, this is someone. Someone is, maybe not uh, Donald Trump, but it's someone amazing. And I have the whole respect for this guy. Anyway, so <laughs> I was, I guess, weird, weird stuff. Bye-bye.